What's up, Warriors? You got d here on another music reaction video. Thanks for making me a part of the start to your weekend. Hopefully, I can add to some of your entertainment. Tonight's reaction request comes to me from Jane Maple, who wanted me to react to Katie Lang on her own, since the very first reaction I ever did of Katie Lang was her and Roy Orbison. The song is The Air That I Breathe, which is a cover of the song of the same name and appears on the Canadian songstress and sometimes actress's 1997 covers album, Drag. The Air That I Breathe is a ballad written by the British Gibraltarian singer, songwriter, and record producer, Albert Hammond, and British singer, composer, and songwriter Mike Hazelwood. Hammond initially recorded the song for his debut album, It Never Rains in Southern California from 1972. Later, according to Wikipedia, one of the leading British rock groups from the 60s to mid 70s, The Hollies, would record it as a single in 1974, reaching number two in the United Kingdom and number six in the United States on the Billboard Hot 100 chart. I never heard Albert Hammond's version of this, but I definitely love The Hollies version. And to be honest with you, I thought the song was a bit older. I thought it was recorded in the 60s. But anyways, I'm here to see what Katie Lang has done with it. And this didn't have an actual music video that I was able to see. So unfortunately, this will be audio only. But I do think that this video has some lyrics. Although I, I think I know the lyrics to this song. I've listened to it so many times. I'll be reacting to Katie Lang's cover of The Air That I Breathe. Sounds different.
how about that cover though i i honestly didn't know what to expect um of this but it was very good before i forget i may have the wrong instrument it definitely sounded like a sitar throughout this song it gave it this mysterious atmosphere uh, i don't know if that's what uh kd and and her band or whoever you know is playing the instruments in this song i don't know if that's what they were going for and again i might even have the wrong instrument i have no idea it sounded like a sitar to me whatever it was it made this song so beautiful so dark so it fit the lyrics like just from what the song is about the content of it the the music went along with that idea and not saying that the hollies when they performed it not saying that their music you know didn't go along with it either no i, I love their version but kd made that so hot like it was just perfect and i definitely loved the control in her voice she was singing it in a lower register but she's also singing it low in um the word is escaping me she's singing it in in low volume and that takes so much control i mean I, i'm not a music theory expert i'm not a paid professional vocalist i'm just going by you know the little bit of training i have had and what i've seen and what i've heard but she displays so much control with her voice and it's beautiful i never really listened to katie i knew of that song constant craving and i was young whenever it came out and for for some reason it wasn't my jam at the time I listen to that song now and I, I love it. It's so crazy though that you can like learn to appreciate artists when you get older. I can actually appreciate Katie Lang right now. She sang a song that I love and she sang it well and she made it her own. She even ended it differently, like the Hollies version just is a, a run on of the chorus and it fades out and she ended it uh go to sleep with that line and that's amazing to me that she had the the thought to change it up and to do that i knew from the moment that i saw it i, I had to look it up to be sure that it was the cover of the hollies well actually albert hammond's song which i didn't know that either Till I did the research but to me it will always be the song by the Hollies but when I saw that title I was like "Ooh, I'm gonna like this I know I'm gonna like it and now hearing what she did with it absolutely amazing thank you so much Jane for suggesting that I take another listen to Katie Lang and that's all I got guys I hope that you enjoyed this reaction if you did please give me a thumbs up if you're new to my channel I hope there's something on here that will make you want to subscribe. I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend, and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye!